Hello guys, welcome back to Seven Engineering YouTube channel. Please subscribe our channel for daily Seven Engineering videos. In today's lecture, we are going to find out the depth and width of a bay. So in this lecture, we are interested only in the cantilever type of the bay. So when there is a length, when there is a cantilever beam of length L, so we are interested to find out the minimum thickness or depth of a beam and minimum width or the breadth of a beam. So according to the ACI, the American Concrete Institute, 31814 code they have given us the formula to find out the minimum depth of the beam and this formula is that the minimum depth this is the minimum the minimum depth for a cantilever type of the beam is d is equal to the d is known as the thickness or the depth of the beam it will be equal to the length of the beam divided by the 8 so length of the beam here let's consider this is 6 meter this is just an example so if it is 6 meter so if we divide 6 meter divide by 8 so it comes out to be 0.75 meter or we can say if you multiply this by 1000 we get 750 millimeter so if you have length if a cantilever beam of length 6 meter then according to the ACI 31814 the minimum depth or thickness for this beam will be equal to the 750 millimeter now what will be the width of the beam if the length of beam is 6 meter is a cantilever type of the beam so the width will be the minimum width or the breadth of the beam will be equal to the b is equal to the d depth of the beam divided by 1.5 now what is d d is 750 millimeter here we find out the minimum thickness so 750 divided by 1.5 we get the minimum width of this beam equal to the 500 millimeter so this is the minimum width for this beam b equal to the 500 millimeter similarly we can also find the minimum depth and width of the for our simply supported beam by this formula where the depth of the beam is equal to l by 16 so for a simply supported beam we can use this formula this is for the simply supported beam i also made a separate video on this uh, topic how to find out the minimum dimensions for a simply supported beam and similarly the width or breadth or the width for a simply supported beam will be equal to the d divided by 1.5 this formula is same for the rectangle for the cantilever and for the simply supported beam but this formula change so according to this formula given by the according to this code ACI 1814 the minimum depth of the cantilever beam is equal to l by 8 and we find out that for 6 meter it will be 750 and the width will be d by 1.5 so it comes out to be 500 millimeter now it will be also noted that the minimum dimension that the minimum uh, width and breadth for a uh, minimum width and depth or thickness for a cantilever beam is equal to the d multiplied with the width equal to the 250 into 250 millimeter this is the minimum dimension for a cantilever beam or for a simply supported beam so in this case our dimensions d is 750 which is greater than the 250 also our width which is 500 millimeter is also greater than the 250 millimeter so in this case our both dimensions are greater than the minimum requirement by the code so our beam is safe according to these dimensions hope you guys understand and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for daily civil engineering videos thank you for watching our video